Okay, that is not what I expected. One year ago, on this day, we put teeth into Coke Zero. Leaving my teeth in Coke for one month. Let's see what happens. Now, I've got close to a thousand subscribers and it's time to finally check the results. So let's go have a look. Here they are. In this cup, we have teeth with just Coca-Cola. In this cup, we've got teeth with an egg as well. It's interesting to see that the ones that have the egg inside, the color is a lot lighter than if it was just the tooth. So I'm gonna take one of each of these and pour it out. Oh, that one smells disgusting. The egg must be rotten or something. God, that is foul. Before we tip it out, I'm gonna do a pH test. So that's the Coke. Let's check the one with the egg. The uh, Coke that had the egg in it, is actually quite green. We're probably looking at a pH of 10. So, whereas the one with just the teeth in it, that's still a bit of a dark yellow color. So we're looking at around a five or a six. Okay, that is not what I expected. One piece of feedback that I had gotten from my original video is that in real life, you don't hold Coke Zero in your mouth. You just sip on it and it only stays in your mouth for maybe two to three seconds. That's true, that makes sense. And actually, in the mouth, what happens is that stimulates more saliva production and that saliva actually helps protect your teeth and neutralize the acid. So that's a similar situation to what has happened in this case, when I had a look online at videos where dentists have done similar experiments, those teeth basically were destroyed in just a few weeks. So I left this tooth in Celsius, the energy drink, for a couple of weeks. Let's take it out and see what it looks like. Holy moly, look at that. It's like completely like splintered. So I'm very shocked that these teeth are practically fine after one year of soaking in Coke Zero. Especially this one here that had the egg in there as well. It basically looks brand new. In the cup where it was just solely the tooth and the Coke Zero, it's a different story. The root of that tooth has gone completely brown. I was expecting that the tooth would be a little bit softer than this. It leads me to think that it may have been cavities which had destroyed the tooth and not the drink itself. In our experiment, there's no cavities and that's because we use Coke Zero which has no sugar and the teeth had been sterilized beforehand as well. So there was no bacteria in this situation which could have caused any cavities. The damage on this tooth is entirely from the drink itself and the acidity of the drink. So that's where we can see that the outside layer of the tooth has gone a bit brown where the acid has softened the tooth and allowed the color of the drink to penetrate into the tooth and cause some of that staining.